The number of people unemployed in Arizona is about a point higher than the national average, 6.6%. But unemployment among veterans is improving. That dropped to 3.8% last month. And many local companies continue looking to hire veterans. A job fair held at State Farm Stadium today. That's where we find Stephanie Olmo live tonight with more. Hey, Steph. Hey guys, that's right. Recruit Military, they're hosting a veterans job fair here at State Farm Stadium. This is an exclusive event open to transitioning service members, veterans, military spouses. There were over 60 exhibitors that showed up looking to fill positions here in Arizona and across the country. For Navy veteran Matt Ashby, finding a job after leaving the military back in 2019 hasn't been easy. I was doing security and protection for assets that they had there. Um, and then the transition was, was tough, trying to find something that, that fit those skills and the training that I received to, to be able to use that and to continue to use that it has been really tough. Especially with the pandemic, the job hunt became even more difficult. After months of filling out online applications, Ashby hopes talking to employers in person will leave more of an impression. People get to kind of see me and, and get a, to know me a little bit more than just an application. Uh, I think my application looks good, but you can stand out more in person, which is nice. Many of the exhibitors here today are prior veterans or veterans themselves have served in the military or in some way connected with the military community. So a lot of times they know kind of that background and are able to really understand when somebody's trying to articulate what they did in the military and how that could possibly correlate to a civilian career. Event director Jen Haddock says today is all about building connections. I hope people walk away, of course, with a job today. That's the number one priority. But really having that confidence knowing that their skill sets are in demand and really critical during this time. If you are a transitioning service member or a veteran and you were unable to attend today's event, there's a list of postings on uh, the Recruit Military's website. We'll have that link on fox10phoenix.com. Reporting live tonight outside of State Farm Stadium, I'm Stephanie Omo, Fox 10 News.